Tell me you're recording. What's up guys, it's Luke. Today we're gonna review these weights. We're gonna do a little workout. Um, you should be able to get a good workout using these bad boys. And yeah, so I'm gonna, I reviewed them, opened them. Now it's time to use them. 40 pound weight set from, uh, where is it from? Coach Jim. Walmart, Walmart weights. That's what we're doing, reviewing Walmart weights. I'm gonna get a good workout, show you guys it's worth the $15 to buy them. All right, so first, First things first, these are the weights. Walmart weights, 40 pounds total. I paid $15 for them, I unboxed it. You can check out that video in my videos that I've made. You can get a whole body workout with these. And I was thinking about how I wanna do this. And basically, we'll just do um, some upper body stuff just to show you. So here we go. All right, so obviously, you see dumbbells, you think curls. So you can do your one, two, you know. Whatever, you can do them together. However you want to do curls. Uh, hammer curls, the weight's not slipping off, so that's cool if you want to do them like that. Then you have another ex good exercise. Um, we'll just focus on upper body, but for this part of the video. Um, so then, if you want to do presses, uh, you can literally press them up. You're gonna get, I mean, it's, it's 40 total pounds. Your muscles are gonna be activated to balance because they're dumbbells. That's the beauty of dumbbells. Forcing both sides of your body to work together in unison. Also, um, and you don't have to, if you're not ready to use 20 pounds on both sides, don't. Um, that's the nice part about these vinyls. Vinyl weights from Walmart, you can take weight off, which is sweet. So let's do some front raises. Boom. Boom. Um, laterals and so on and so forth with the dumbbells and these are slowly getting heavier as I'm carrying them uh, you get the benefit of doing some leg stuff you can do some awesome compound movements supersets or however you want to supersets and compound movements full body exercises yeah so let's say you want to do a little lunge and I'll have to face the hidden camera for this but you just hold the hold them up here and lunge down and press. And you're gonna switch legs, lunge down and press. And what's awesome is you're working the upper and lower body. I'll probably put together a video uh, after I cut this. I'll move the camera and stuff. But um, I'll do a full body workout using these this 40 pounds. And I guarantee if you do that workout too. You're gonna be so happy with yourself. Um, you'll get it in, which is sweet. All right, so I'm just gonna use the 40 pounds. I'm uh, not gonna, I'm not gonna deviate from that. That's the point. Fifteen dollars will get you an awesome start on your home gym. You don't need a lot, and it doesn't cost a lot. Behind me, I have this uh, Olympic weight set. I bought it when I was 17, so like, don't think I went out and bought a $400 weight set. It was initially four or five hundred dollars. I ended up paying like 170 when I was 17. Um, it sat in the basement forever. That's why we got the truffle shuffle shirt going on. The truffle shuffle shirt. Let's uh, let's get this workout in. All right. I showed you a couple moves. Now I'm gonna use all those moves in a full body workout, which is the fun part. The fun part is the full body workout. This is the fun part too. Setting up videos. Can you see me? Uh, that's not good. And I got a All right, so you can kind of see me after forever of trying to figure out how to do best audio and whatever. So first moves, we're gonna take our 20s. Let's do the shoulder press and lunge, like I showed you. So we're gonna go one, press. Keep them up, woo, bounce up. Two, press. Three, press. Four, there we go. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. And then you can do the trucks. Eight, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. 
gonna do some curls. Back to the presses. Up. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ten. Woo! I'm gonna take a rest. Woo! So my heart rate's already up, and I don't know. It felt like 40 pounds to me, so it's cool. Weights stay down. Um, bang out a few of those. I don't know if it was boring for you guys, but after about 30 seconds of rest, I'll do it two more times with the presses. My well, heavy shrugs are better, but still working on them. And honestly, if you want to add more curling, I would just do some sets alone after the workout. Um, honestly, it's just like a rest for the for the legs, the shoulders mostly. Shoulders are easy. You could keep doing that for half an hour and you're gonna be shot. Especially the shoulder thing. Those presses were getting to me. If I was gonna keep pressing, I'd probably have to lower the weight. I'm, not, I'm honestly not used to doing shoulder presses at all. So there's that. Um, but I did wanna show, I wanted to show one more thing regarding the versatility of the dumbbell itself. So, generally, if you get one of these, this is also a if you get one of these, it's also a 20 pound weight. Also sell these at Walmart, but it's probably 15 bucks just for that one. Um, but the good thing with the solid weight, you can use them as a more of a, a kettlebell um, for stuff like swinging it. That's one thing to consider, but you don't have to do kettlebell swings, so I don't, uh, they're great, but I don't think if you're going to spend 15 bucks on one of those versus the two dumbbells, um, get the two dumbbells because you can do both arms simultaneously when you're lunging or uh, squatting, like you can squat, you can just hold them in front of you and squat. And if you want to do the press, do it, but you don't have to. You could even hold them to your side and do like a close like squat or a deadlift with them. Um, I'll stand back. So if you're going to do like sumo squats with these for higher reps, you're going to burn a lot of calories holding on to the 40 pounds or any uh, variation of that. You're not going to be able to see this, but I'm going to dismantle here real quick. All right. This is what I was excited about. Because you're buying two, you could take your seven and a half and put them on one dumbbell. And now you have a 30 pound dumbbell, right? Seven and a half, 15, 15, 30. So um, just th that's another thing to consider. Um, just have to have the one dumbbell. And what I like this idea for, I haven't tried it, so if it falls apart and breaks, then I'll take it back. But 
Um, you can do your 30 pound snatches with this now um, without having to get any more equipment than the $15 weight you bought. So let's say I want to snatch that weight. I'm doing a 30 pound snatch now. Pretty excited about that. I have the 20s that are, um, and I can do it with two arms, but working individual sides with a snatch, that was bad for him. But being able to do these snatches with one arm, working individual sides, so the left is gonna be to doing the same work as your right, and so on and so forth. And even then, I can do 30, 30 pound curls with a 30 pound dumbbell, 30 pound upright row on one side. Um, you can do your rows with the 30 for your back. So that's another thing to consider if you're gonna get these Walmart weights. So Walmart sells a 15 pound dumbbell set. It is vinyl, so it's probably not gonna last it quite as long, maybe. But if you're just starting out, perfect. It's perfect. So that's just another thing. Be, be creative with your weight uh, with the vinyl here. Like I said, uh, if you superset these snatches, and I'll do a set. It's like great full body. You're gonna burn calories. And then superset it with your rows. And you don't need a bench to lean on, lean on your couch or something. So yeah, you see that, it's a set. I got to use 30 pounds. I don't have a 30 pound dumbbell, I do now. Granted, I only have one because I didn't buy two sets of that, but go to Goodwill, they always have vinyls on sale. Vinyl weights are cheap, so if you're gonna start your home gym, I'd say that's a bonus buy to get that $15 weight set and just be a little creative with it. Woo, I'm breathing hard. I'm gonna finish my workout. I don't need to videotape it. You guys see what I'm about to do. Hope you liked it. Subscribe. Yeah, subscribe. Please subscribe. I'm gonna finish my workout. You can see that it's definitely worth it. Definitely, definitely, definitely worth it to get the 15 pound Walmart weight set. Walmart.